சி வாயனம திருச்சிற்றம்பலம் வெல்கம் பேக் டு அவர் டிஸ்காஷன் ஆன் த நைன்த் திருமுறை செவன்டீன்த் திருப்பதிகம் அண்ட் த ஃபினாலே வேர்ஸ் விச் இஸ் வேர்ஸ் நம்பர் டென் வேர்ஸ் கோஸ் திஸ் வே திருச்சிற்றம்பலம் ஒருங்கீரும் கண்ணின் எண்ணின் புன்மாக்கள் ஒருங்கீருள் நாடுனல் யாமத்து ஓர் கருங்கண்ணின் ரீமைக்கும் செழுஞ்சுடர் விளக்கங்கு கலந்தென கலந்துணர் கருவோர் தருங்கரும் வனைய தீந்தமுள் மாலை தடம் போழில் வாருதையால் ஊதிப்ப வருங்கரும் கண்டத்து அண்டவானவர்கோன் மாறுவீடம் திருவேடை மாறுதே திருச்சிற்றம்பலம் this uh, verse comes as a falashruti which is also called as tirukadai kaap to say what is going to be the benefit of a soul who is reading this padigam we all know we will be working only in form or only when we are getting any kind of returns imagine we are all working hard so hard to earn money why because we know the next time when we are hungry we need to earn our food imagine a situation where we are not going to have hunger do you think we are going to be working so hard no way we will all be lazy we will all be sitting around and lazing around as if it's nobody's business so there is an expectation from everything that we do so is there an expectation of reading a padigam yes we do have it so if someone has an expectation what is that they are going to achieve is given in this particular verse so here karuvur tevar says imagine someone sitting in a meditation and the entire night they are waking up and they are sitting in meditation what will happen is once they get on to the right state of maturity lord shiva will come in in the form of a glowing light to give them a clarity in their in their journey spiritual journey for the others they will have they'll be having a peaceful sli- sleep in the night and they won't be bothered about anything else similar to animals animals don't be bothered about them sitting for meditation or whatever right they just have a, have their sleep and when they are hungry they just hunt and that's it other than that they don't have any big purposes in life so if i'm a human born as a human being but i'm not going to work on my spiritual growth growth i'm as good as an animal so here karur devar says as a human being what we should be doing is sit for meditation the entire night alternatively you can also sit and read this padigam if we sit and read this padigam what will happen is we will start achieving the state of realization or we will start achieving the state of yoga and that is the state where lord shiva will come in as a glowing light to give us a clarity in our spiritual path so how sh- what a shortcut that we are getting here right instead of working so hard and waking up in the night and sitting for meditation and struggling with whatever is happening all we have to do is practice our mind to read padigams on a regular basis so that all as in the state of yoga is already achieved because there is already a synchronicity with our words with our mind as well as with our body because when we are sitting and reading all these comes into one synchronicity and that is the state of yoga anyways that is the advantage of reading padigams so that is what verse number 10 is all about i'll come back again with the next padigam uh, very soon until then sivaya namath tirchitrambala